A chore play. I've never done that. I, I think it's just another trend, another somewhat ridiculous trend that somebody's putting out there to, I don't know, to negotiate real desire. You just really can't negotiate that. She either wants to be with you or she doesn't. You either want to be with her or you don't. You're not going to be able to, well, I'll do this if you do that. I mean, you can do that and you may have good sex, but it's still not going to be the same thing as her actually desiring you and wanting to be with you. I don't see it. But if if you're taking advice from women, what's that like trying to catch a fish by talking to the fish, how they want to be caught? It's the same thing. A lot of times women think these things. Well, yeah, I'd really appreciate my man more if he did this. Yeah, that sounds to a woman that sounds good. But how many times do women not really know what makes them attracted to a man? So I think in their mind, they're thinking, yeah, this is a good idea. And I need some help around the house. And to back up on, you guys were talking about, one of you guys said something about uh, cooking. Yeah, to ask a woman or tell you want a woman to cook or to clean, they see that as subservient. I mean, and it's actually just part of what they do. And you as a man, it's no different than you as a man going out and what they want to call you. You could call yourself, well, you just want a workhorse. You want a man to support you. You just want a workhorse. But men don't look at it like that. But the modern women look at it like, well, you want somebody to cook and clean? I watched a show 30 years ago where a man was up on stage, I think on Oprah, and he said he wanted to dress in a wife that cooked and cleaned, and he just got ranted almost off the stage for that back then, and it's even more so now. So I don't see how that does anything except demean the man by him seeking her approval that maybe she's going to honor him or bless him with something. It seems ridiculous to me. Yeah, I, I I I sense that as well. Wraith, you've had some experience with long-term relationships. What's your thoughts on this whole um, propensity to say chore play is something that's really important in order to get sexual favors in the bedroom <coughs> if it's waning in your relationship? I think you've got more problems if that's what you're bringing up. Yeah, I don't necessarily think it's important. Um, I find myself that if I clean the house, I clean it better than she does. And then <laughs> she gets depressed because she can't maintain the standard of cleanliness that I would like in my life. So um, it doesn't, from it's never worked. I never did it uh, in this sense that I was trying to get something for it, but I did, I did do it as an example of the standard of cleanliness and uh, the standard of living that I wanted, but it wasn't really chore play. It was teaching her how to clean the house, just like teaching her how to cook. How dare you? haven't already join thor's the dragons membership it's a men's monthly interactive video meeting in cyberspace this is a masculine place for men that is censorship free to increase your performance as well as converse and leverage ideas and get coaching consultations on how to handle life's issues in a modern world this is a unique place this is the discreet place and it's the place for men so what are you waiting for join the dragons membership link below